Okay. Um, we're going to start at about 40% effort. Get the knees nice and high. Take it off the fifth day. Next day, seventh day, eighty, ninety, hundred percent. Everything you have. Let's go. Ben, you look like such a wee football coach. If I was to picture what a football coach looks like, it would be you. <laughs> okay, we're going to go in for some um, star jumps. So let's go for 40 fast pace reps. Um, you'll need to be careful not to bulk your way Nutella biscuits back up. <laughs> okay. Yeah, they're the fucking dog's balls. I'm telling you now. <laughs> they're amazing. And they're powerful to be far. I'll bring, I'll bring you in a packet when the gym, gym opens up again. <laughs> they're not vegan, but are they? You want even car? <laughs> okay, we're going to go for a wee bit of mobility, peeps. Okay, so I want everyone to come into a deep lunge. So take a nice big deep lunge forward and drop the wee hands down the floor. So you want your. Let me just show you. So you want. Your foot in line with both your hands. So there's a nice straight line here, okay? And then the hand beside the foot is going to come up to the sky. Going to follow it up with the right leg, follow it back down, trying to get that elbow on the floor, okay? Let's go five reps on each side. Okay. After that, we're going to come into a downward dog position. So from here, you're going to push the hips up towards the sky. Okay, trying to get that head right through the arms. From here, you are going to drop the elbows down to the floor and you are bringing the head right through, really opening up that chest. Okay, so you're trying not to drop the hips right down to the floor. Just really focusing on opening up that chest. Okay, from here, we're going to come back into our downward dog and we are going to repeat. Let's go for 10 reps. Trying to get those wee elbows nice and low to the floor. Pushing the hips straight back up. Really focus on trying to get that chest nice and open. Should be feeling a wee bit of a stretch in the hamstrings here.
Well, try and focus on getting your wee elbows a bit lower to the floor whenever you're bringing the head through the arms. Okay, so try and drop the elbows right down. So from there, drop the elbows. Yes. On real pain. Okay. After that, we're going to go for some shoulder carms. Okay, so everyone come into a tall kneeling position. So come up onto your knees. And I want you to imagine that your entire body is in cement, except for your shoulder. Okay, so we're going to externally rotate the shoulder. So the, the palm of your hand is going to be facing out the way. Okay, we're going to bring it across the body. Okay, so we're trying to maintain that. So trying to keep that hand facing forward. Remembering that we are stuck in cement, okay? And I want you to imagine that that hat, that arm is going through really, really thick fur, okay? So you're gonna get the point around your ear where your, your hand physically can't stay rotated out anymore, okay? So that is where you will then internally rotate the shoulder. And the finishing position is going to be here. So your hand is going to be facing out the way. And then we are going to bring it back round. Back in the inter external rotation. Okay. Everyone do a couple of reps on each side. So we are starting with the hand, palm of the hand facing outwards, bringing it across the body, right up until the bicep is here. Just not get it, Orlin. We understand. So yeah, you're bringing the hand right across the bottom, okay? So right across here. So you're trying not to compensate any movement from the rest of your body, okay? So imagine the shoulder joint is the only thing you want to move. So try not to move your head, okay? Everything's in cement. <laughs> ben, I have no words. <laughs> what is he on, Orla? Ben, are you okay, hon? <laughs> you all right, Ben? I'm not made for these 5 a.m. starts. This is... Yeah, I'd work on and you had a few drinks last night as well, didn't you? I went into the work, had my performance review, and they went, you're a good worker, but sometimes you're tired and you're pretty useless. <laughs> Just be like, bitches, please. This is because she's put me on back-to-back -back shifts. Stop doing that, and they won't be as tired then. Yeah, I'm tired. Eight hours is not enough. I agree. I agree, brother. Preach. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're going to get started then, please, okay? So... Today's workout is called decades. So what that means is we're doing five different exercises, okay? So we're gonna be going up in the rep range of 10. So first exercise is gonna be 10 reps. Second is gonna be 20. Third is gonna be 30, 40, 50. Once you've completed your 50 reps, we're then gonna work our way back down. So 40, 30, 20, 10. Okay, so we're going to be starting with 10 half burpees. So let me just show you. 
So for your half work break, hands are coming down to the floor, kicking the feet back, feet back in, jump up high. If you can't manage to half work B or you have any kind of injury and it's too high impact, then I want you to bring your hands down to the floor, step one foot back, other foot back, one foot in, one foot in. Okay, so that just keeps the impact out of it all together. After that, we are in the 20 butterfly setups. So for that, just gonna move back to the door. Feet are together in front of you. You are planting your feet down into the floor. You touch the floor in front, down onto your back, touch the floor at the back, and repeat for 20 reps. Pull the bends. And then we are into 30 glute bridge. So we're staying on the floor for this wee one. Down onto your back. <clears throat> Before you do any kind of movement with this, I want you to make sure there's no space between your back and the floor. Okay, so push the core down into the floor. From here, you are then going to bridge your hips up towards the sky. So I'm not looking for this, okay? You're not going to get much movement here if you have the correct starting position, okay? Bridging the hips up, tipping the floor or tipping the bum off the floor without completely resting it here. After that, we are into 40 lunges. So we're going to go 20 lunge on each set. For then, you are dropping the back knee down to the floor. So trying to create a 90-90 position with the front knee, the front leg and the back leg. Okay. After that, we're in the 50 squats. Trying to create as much tension here in the legs as possible. So really focus on turning that foot apart. Keeping the chest up nice and high. Squat down. Back up. Thanks. Anyone, any questions? All good to go. Can I have something else to settle on, just please? Of course. Um, well, it's up to you. Do you want to go mountain climbers or do you want to go single leg loop bridge? Give me mountain climbers, sweet change. Okay, go slow, man. <laughs> Don't listen to him, he's a okay. What he say? <laughs> Knock him out. You want to be bag with your 40 mountain climbers? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Knock him out, Rebecca. Part A. Told you. Well, you okay, getting ready to go. I'm going to set a wee timer as well because everyone's going to be at different levels, okay? So we are starting with 10 half burpees in three, two, one. Off we go. I just love seeing all the couples on, just taking the absolute piss out of each other. It's so funny. <laughs> Do we go straight on to our next exercise? Yes, so you're straight in for your 20 glute, or 20 uh, butterfly setup. Remember, we're trying to keep them feet planted into the ground. Once you've done your butterfly setups, 20 reps, we are into 30 glute bridge. Woo, little doggy. <laughs> Woo. 
And to get that back knee right down to the floor. lunge on each leg. And then we're into 50 squats. Don't be afraid to break the lunges up. You can do two sets of 10 on each leg and then take a wee break. You don't need to fire them all out at once. And if they feel a wee bit unstable as well, don't be afraid to grab onto the side of the sofa, table or whatever. Good job, pipes. Twenty lunges on each side, and then fifty squats. You can do five sets of ten, two sets of fifteen. Do it whatever way you want. If you need a break, don't be afraid to grab a break. Grab a wee bit of water. for that. See with your wee squat, Ben and Orla, it might help you if you get your elbows a wee bit tighter. So coming down and then bringing the hands out to the side. And then is it 50 back to 10? Yes. So once you've done your 50 right. squats, you're back into your lunges, okay?
Trying to keep the chest nice and high with the squats. Try and really fake that chest coming forward. Is it to go back into the 40 lunges? Yes. No, it's burpees. Oh. <laughs> 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 <Let's go back>. <laughs> <laughs> You all good, Stace? Can't hear you. Do we do another round, yeah? So once you've done your 50 squats, we're back in the 40 lunges, right down to oh, 10, get on. 10 half burpees. Okay, I'm gonna, we'll go for another two minutes. Doing amazing, peeps. We're nearly there. Remember, with the bigger wrap branches, do not be afraid to break up the wraps. So you can do a few sets of 10, a few sets, whatever whatever way you need to. Or if you just want to par through them all and take a few wee breaks in between, to catch your breath back, grab some water. And they are last 30 seconds. Actually, John, you're nearly finished. Finish your half burpees and then we'll finish up with that. Everyone start to get finished up, whatever reps you are on. You okay, or Paul? It's your back sore? Shins? What? Can't hear you. My hip, I have hip dysplasia. Right, so. Making it easy. You take an evening, don't you worry. Okay. <clears throat> Finish up whatever you are on, peeps. And we're going to take a wee rest while I talk through the next round, okay? Okay. So next round is going to be 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off. So we're going to be starting with... Hang on. What pulse? Okay, so we're going to be squatting down until the hips are just above the knee. And we're going to pulse for 40 seconds, trying to keep our chest nice and high. Okay, after that, we are into a plank press. Coming down to the floor, tall plank position. Hang on, let me just move it. Tall plank position, squeezing the glutes, bracing the core, down onto the forearms, and make sure the chest and the hips come down together. 
Back up onto the hands, chest and hips, back up together as well. So that is all moving as one throughout the whole movement, okay? If that's too far, go for a plank shoulder tap. So from here, keep the feet a wee bit wider. We're gonna go opposite hand, the opposite shoulder. And then we are into downward dog crunches. So, and the downward dog position that we were in in the warm up. Okay, so head is coming through the arms. From here, we are going to fully extend one leg out, trying to keep that leg as straight as possible. We are then going to bring the head through. So the chest is then directly over the hands. Fully extend the leg back out, bringing that knee into the elbow. Trying to keep that leg nice and straight. Okay. So we're going to do 40 seconds on one side, 40 seconds on the other side with the downward dog. Does anyone have any questions? No? All good to go. Happy days. So we are starting with a squat pulse. In three, two, one. Let's go. Trying to keep our chest nice and high. So we are only trying to move with the hips here, okay? Try and go a wee bit deeper, Orla. Yes, there you go. Try and come up even a wee bit more. So come out of it a tiny bit more. And rest. Okay, 20 seconds rest. Getting ready for our plank press. <clears throat> five seconds three two one off we go tom try and bring the wee hips down yes there you go on real pipes Squeeze the glutes as hard as you can, okay? That's going to help you create a wee bit more stability. Keep it going. And rest. Well done. Okay, getting ready for downward dog crunches next, okay? So ending our downward dog position. Going to fully extend one leg out, trying to keep that leg as straight as possible. Three, two, one. Hips up towards the sky. Bringing the chest right through. Okay, so watch me, John. Okay, so the downward dog section, that's the start of the section here. Your feet are together and the head is through the arms. When you extend one leg up and then you are bringing the chest right through. Okay. So starting position, the head is through the arms. So get the head right through. And rest. 20 seconds rest, getting ready to do the opposite side. Okay, so get ready to switch sides. Three, two, one. Off we go. So we're trying to keep that wee extended leg as straight as we can. Don't worry if it bends a wee bit, that is okay. As long as you're trying to keep it straight. Whew. 
Okay, Stefan. And rest. I what? struggle on that. Why? What? Like, do you feel like you're not doing it right? I get my head and the shoulders are locked in and stuff, so it's a bit difficult. That's okay. Don't worry. Um, you looked grand doing it on the second round, so it's all good. It's, yeah, just, I'll, I'll look. it's just a lack of shoulder mobility, so don't be worrying. You're grand. Um, everyone's not going to be have the same range of motion. Do you know what I mean? So do not stress. It is all good in the heart, right? So we're going to do a wee two-minute finisher, okay? Just all know what that means. <laughs> two-minute bur max burpee finisher, and then we are done. <laughs> Love you. <laughs> okay. If you struggle with the burpees, again, do the simplified version, okay? You don't need to do the full burpees. The main thing is to just move through the two minutes and finish the two minutes without dying, okay? <laughs> okay. Grab some water if you need it. We'll get ready to go in a few seconds. I'll let you get your breath back first. <laughs> Orlin Ben, how's the weather over in Manchester? Is it nice? It was lovely yesterday, but it's a bit cloudy today. It's too hot to sleep. Yes, yeah, you know where it's like warm when you're sleeping? Yeah, I hear that. That's yeah, the worst. It's like Benidorm. <laughs> Crazy Pedro's pizza, though. Powerful. Yes, <laughs> yes that, was, that was worth it. I love it. Like, I went to Manchester. Like, and, you, and you only saw the slice I showed you. <laughs> <laughs> it's, only, it's only like two pounds it's what well, it's so cheap i can't remember but i literally lived there when i went to manchester and we went up. loved up i know it's good you know i'm sure it was just nice to get out for just a bit of normality i know everyone was just in good form to be out i know i know right is everyone ready to rock and roll for the last two minutes Let's do this shit. You've got this. I believe in every single one of you. Because we're going to kill it. Okay. Three, two, one. Let's go. As many burpees as you can. I recommend going at a steady enough pace, okay? So you don't want to completely burn yourself out. On real pipes. These are doing amazing. We're nearly there. Don't be afraid to grab a wee bit of water if you need it. And they are last minute. You having a wee boogie, see it's like. <laughs> Last 30 seconds, guys. Doing amazing. We're nearly there. Five seconds. And rest. <laughs> Unreal. 
Well done, everyone. Oh, thanks, Rosie. Thank you. No problem. Let's get a wee photo before you go. What on camera? Said what? Let the concert pause.